What's up guys, this is Pastor Canai again. This is a different day. So right now we're going to be doing um, a simple calculator using if statements. You know, a four operational, four operator, as you say, four operator calculator. Okay, we're going to start. Um, yeah, let's declare the let's declare the variable type first. So we're going to be using doubles. So to give it a name, num1 and num2. Okay, and then we're going to be for the op operators, we're going to be using a string, which is going to be a op. Okay, oh man, what happened? I want to get okay, cool. Now let's do a um, Let's ask uh, the user just to enter the inputs and stuff. So console. First question is enter the first the first number. The first number. Okay. Semicolon. Now let's uh, let's store their answer into the double variable no yeah we already have that so let's just do num1 um so because this is numbers we have to convert it so let's use a convert that to double um Okay. So, okay, we're going to it's going to enter the number. We're going to store the number on the variable num one, and it's going to be converted. Yeah. Um. Now, um, let's copy this. Let's um, do it again. So enter the second number. Which is going to be, uh, just change right here. It's going to be an M2. So now let's enter the, the operator. Console. On. Enter the OP, uh, you know, enter uh, uh, OP later. Okay. Now for the if statements, because we want to do four operators, right? It's going to be plus minus division multiplication okay we're going to use the if statement we're going to pass a condition right here what's going to be a condition if oh no actually i forgot right here so let's pass that op console the right no what is the right read when you pass a string, you always have to use the console read line. Okay. Now, so if op equals to to plus, what I wanted to do, do addition so which is going to be no going to be num1 plus num2 cool so let's copy all of this because basically we're going to be doing the same thing copy 
Okay, let's change it now. Let's put an else if it's going to be a minus. Minus right here. It's going to be a division. Change division. And now it's going to be a multiplication right here. Let's add that else here. Now, so in case they enter the wrong op op operator, so let's just do else. Invalid. Invalid um, input. You know. Oh, invalid. Oh, operate. Yeah, let's do input. No operator. Okay. Um, should be good. Yeah, should we get now? Let's just uh, run it and see if this works. Um. Okay, enter the first number. Let's do a four. Enter the second number. Let's do a four. Enter the op enter an operator. Let's do plus. And the answer is eight. Good. So let's do a multiplication now. Let's run again. Enter the first number, let's do five. Enter the second number, let's do ten. Let's do an operator. Give me fifty. Yeah, cool. Now let's enter the wrong operator. And that works. Let's see. Enter the first number. Let's do a three. Three. Uh, let's do a number. Invalid operator. Cool. So basically, this program is working fine. Nice. Um. Yeah. So I'm doing this video just for maybe help out somebody. But at the same time, it's kind of will help me to go back in the future and see what I did. But cool, so hopefully you guys like the video. I don't have subscribers yet. Who's gonna be the first?